hello good and wonderful people welcome back again it's your girl ab world entertainment good morning good afternoon and good evening depending on the time you guys are watching me from how are you guys doing i hope you all are doing great my country people happy easter to everyone in the house i just want to quickly drop this wonderful message from one great man of god all the way from canada i can want you to quickly drop the message as easter yesterday go on as we they enjoy the easter so my people happy easter to you uh how are you spending your holiday how are you celebrating the resurrection of jesus christ because he died for our sin and he rose again on the third day so today Mon uh, monday easter i come across a video on my facebook so this video is so super you understand it shows that real men of god still there inside this world you understand men of god that has fire that have that is that can say to this mountain be that removed and the mountain we hear the word of the lord we hear the name of the lord and it will shake off it will just disappear instantly you understand so me i'm not calling on the body of christ the whole christianity in the whole world say me kuna a bear because this something i need to break up for english because of this white people you understand i hope pray me they don't bring this my video down because the topic where i will write put and not be the one where they will take bring them down you understand uh -huh. so it say the church of the lord will march on and the gate of hell will never prevail against it this video one of the worst so now it's a canada now it will happen one great man of god will be like elisha he can't come outside the way he did do to this uh, canadian police people eh? oh my god oh my god oh my god oh my god christ have risen again yes this one really should say our god is not asleep our heavenly father not they sleep at all our baba the owner of the whole universe not they sleep they don't feel use this uh, cordelia marcus they deceive everybody for this word. You understand? God bless you, man of God. I'm going to leave this video for you to play. But before you play, I have to uh, uh, add to what is happening here for you people to understand what in the shell for inside this uh, video. This man, a man of God, he get a festival where they do every year in their church, just like you are doing anniversary, uh, church anniversary, or this. Uh, um, native uh, anniversary just like everybody will wear native to church you understand uh -huh. so now that they do for this church for canada what you can happen my people oh my god oh my god oh my god so there are still men of god that can pull mouthy hallelujah to the king of glory hallelujah to your neighbor by heaven really you died you died on the third day and you rose again you rose again. This one really shows that our father is alive. Oh my God. Jesus, you are worthy. You are marvelous. You are worthy to be praised. Hallowed be your name forevermore. May your name be praised forevermore. Thank you, Father, Lord Jesus, King of glory, for showing to the world that you are still, you are God. You have ever been God. You are still God. Till eternity. You understand? My people. This one shocked me. It shocked me. Hey, hey, hey. It shockalized me as my brother worry body talking. It shocked you. It shocked everybody, my people. <laughs> Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Hallelujah to the King of Glory. This man is Elijah of our time, my people. He is Elijah of our time. Okay, my people. May I go into the message properly so that I now understand where I they come from? Okay, what did happen for inside this um, video owner they see for here my daily uh fans uh, all this uh olokba this uh hey, all this olokba they just enter inside the pastor church without any uh, uh search of warrants you understand so they work on the the um, scatter the the service say they no fee gather and not be said they just mush you understand and anybody will be three for family one person will come if you be five for family, one person will come but that's a service must hold you understand because say they know even this time around they know even can't and join and say church go close you understand and yours that stay uh don't be discount yourself distant yourself you understand and here one meter from others now waiting the authority talk you understand so a lot of churches have been opening the next thing now they all decide church what you call your happen uh a lot by us come as your lock by us come now they say the service no fee hold up. They have to close the church. Oh my God! Who says who? From where? 
Now the pastor shout, where your 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 search warrant? Is they say they not they forget them for office. Hey hey hey! Now you come inside my church. Hey, my people, people are not mind me the way I tell the shout. So you understand? Because I'm seeing another Elijah of our time. When prophet Elijah came out, he said, "If I be a man of God, let the fire from heaven above let it fall." You understand? And he consumed. The work of center. You understand? So this man is another Elisha of our time. Oh my God. So this man is not calling on this pastor. Sorry, sir, for calling you this man. This pastor is not calling on all the body of Christ, calling up all the churches that they should please stand up for Christ. That is, see, all these people, they want to take over the whole world. No. Because Bible talk and say, the church will march on, but the gate of hell cannot prevail against it. I'm giving you this video for Easter Monday, for you to enjoy your Easter Monday. Because yesterday, our Lord Jesus Christ rose up from the grave. He rose up after three days. After three days, he rose up. Hallelujah to the King of Glory. Jesus. Hallelujah. This, man, this pastor now said to these people, if you don't have your search warrant, you go. He said, may they leave this property because the property not be government. Oh, my people. Ah, me could not take an easy. Who know why you claim the whole world just like that because of Cordelia Marcos? Because of Cordelia Festus? He no do, he no good. Ah, please, Christian, let's wake up. Let's stop fighting ourselves. Let's wake up. Let's take the mantle by the horn. Let's take it. Let's stand for the church of God. Just like this man stood for the church of Christ. By chasing this Olokba away from his church. He said, they say, oh yes, I they see you now. Man, they see you now back. <laughs> we touch. In only two seconds. See as Olokba, they march out from inside church, my people. I never see this kind of thing before. I never see this kind of thing before. Ah, may this Easter be the beginning of Christianity. The beginning where Christians go take a fight for the right of God. Not be saying that we won't fight for, for God, though, you understand? Uh -huh. We know they fight for, for our God. Now, our God, they fight for Himself, you understand? Because He is the living God. He is the owner of the whole universe, you understand? Uh -huh. Now, all those uh, Shango, Olokun, Ohomila, Ogbanje, now, then, now those ones that they fight for. But our God, we don't fight for our God. He fought for Himself. What He's just saying that, what the Word of God is saying that we should stand as a Christian. You understand? Because end time is already at hand. Because of what they happen for the world now. Yes, end time is at hand. You understand? Because this kind Cordelia Marcos, we work out common side. So the one you not deceive everybody, love everybody to the extent say church not even they open a gate. Church not they open a gate. Why? The work not day, the way you they give everybody tashere, tashere money for inside has we know reach you tell they leave. But if you work for yourself, you will be okay. Except those who are lazy, except those who don't want to work, and here they can live on gov government benefit. But the people that have strength, let me they leave them, may they go work. So now this man called out. He pursued them instantly. So yes, I see you now. So may they see you now back. He asked them, say, where on a uh, search warrant, on a thing, enter inside premises. They don't see and bring come outside. How can you just come and say you want to stop the church of Christ? It's impossible. It's impossible. Our God is a consuming fire. Ha! This is another prophet, Elisha. My people, I'm not going to take for this video. I will leave when I'm going to watch the remaining part i beg if today happens to be the first time of coming across this video or you fail to watch me you never subscribe oh my god please do subscribe watch subscribe and share okay so my new subscriber you are wonderfully welcome to this wonderful platform happy easter to you guys and so my returning subscriber oh my god christ died for you on the cross on the cross of calvary and he rose again because of you mm, all your sins your troubles your tribulation, your worries, your fears, God have brought them away yesterday that he rose up. You understand? Every dead thing in your lives, 
those who are washing, those who are sharing, those who are committing, those who are leaving a, 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 a thumbs up, my subscriber, those who have not subscribed, Christ died for you and he rose up for, for your glory to shine. So guys, continue to shine on. Happy Easter once again. Wow. Happy Easter to everyone that is going to listen to this video. That is going to share this video. Please let this video go viral for them to know that Prophet Elijah is back again. Oh my God. The church of God will march on. And the gate of hell will never prevail against it. God bless everyone. God bless you all. God bless this pastor. May God give you more strength, more anointing, more grace to carry on the work of God. So please make we get up. Worship our Papa with the heaven. Make we let the world know, say, our Papa is still alive. Now he get his word. No matter how they want to use this Cordelia first or deceive us rich. Papa God is in heaven. So my people are going to live and make we watch the many of this video. Bye everyone. Choose I remain your humble sister. Abby Ward Entertainment. Please Love get you out. everyone. Bye bye. Get out of this property. Immediately get out. Get out of this property immediately. Out. I don't want to hear anything. Out of this property immediately. I don't want to hear a word. Out. Out. Out of this property immediately until you come back with a warrant. Out. 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 Out of this property. Immediately out. Immediately go out and don't come back. Don't, I don't want to talk to you. Okay. Not a word. Out of this pro out of this property immediately. Out. I don't care what you have to say. Out. Out. Out of this property, you Nazis. Out. Out. Gestapo is not allowed here. Immediately, Gestapo is not allowed. Out. Do you understand English? Get out of this property. Go. So go. Go. And don't come back without the warrant. Out, Nazi. Out. Out. You understand? Nazis are not welcome here. Out. And don't come back without the warrant. Do not come back without the warrant. You understand that? You're not welcome here. Nazis are not welcome here. The Gestapo is not welcome here. Do not come back, you Nazi psychopaths. Unbelievable, sick, evil people. Intimidating people in a church during the Passover. You Gestapo, Nazi, communist, fascists. Don't you dare coming back here. Can you imagine those psychopaths? Passover. The holiest Christian festival in a year. And they're coming to intimidate Christians during the holiest festival? Unbelievable. What is wrong with those sick psychopaths? It's beyond me. Wow. Wow. How dare they? How dare they? Sick people. Sick people. Unbelievable. We're living in a takeover, a total takeover of the government with their sags, guns, the brown shirts, the Gestapo wannabe dictators coming to the church with armed with guns and tasers and handcuffs to intimidate during Passover celebration. Well, I guess that's what it is. They want to enslave us all like the Egyptians did. They want to be pharaohs of today. That's what they're doing. Unbelievable. People, if you will not wake up, stand up. Wow, I, I don't know what is going to happen tomorrow. If Canadians will not rise up. Look what is happening in Germany. Germany is taken over by fascism again. The wannabe Hitlers are already ruling. You cannot even leave from one city to another. It's a total lockdown. If you will not be vaccinated like a dog or a cat, you will not be able to buy or sell. You will not be able to go to school or work. 
Is that the future you want? Is that what you want for your children and your grandchildren? Seriously, is that the future of Canada? That's the future of Canada? Wow, unbelievable. Friends, you gotta join the fight. We have rallies. We are meeting every week and we need numbers. We need to stand up against them and we need to file lawsuits against their craziness right now while we still have that window of opportunity. Because if we don't do it now, I don't think we're going to have tomorrow. Our rights are being taken away from us so quickly. It's, it's unbelievable. The Gestapo.